Our top story this morning, US intelligence agencies have grave suspicions. North Korea is building a submarine capable of launching ballistic missiles. The development raises fresh concerns about the missile and nuclear threat posed by the regime. Ashin Semin has this report. You're looking at North Korean leader Kim Jong-un sitting atop of a Romeo-class submarine. The photos of Kim surfaced in June when he visited a naval unit of the Korean People's Army and, according to North Korean state media, conducted a drill and instructed the captain on navigation methods. His visit is part of North Korea's efforts to shore up the underwater operation capability of its submarines. And it seems the North is making inroads. U.S.-based media outlet Washington Free Beacon reports that U.S. defense intelligence agencies recently detected a previously unseen missile launch tube on a North Korean submarine. North Korea is reportedly developing a ballistic missile submarine that, if confirmed to be true, would significantly raise a threat posed by the nuclear-armed communist state. According to the report, U.S. intelligence shows Pyongyang is developing a submarine capable of launching ballistic missiles. North Korea is also believed to have already obtained submarine-launched ballistic missiles from Russia. Pentagon spokesman Jeffrey Poole refused to comment on the report, saying he was not allowed to discuss matters of national intelligence. However, he did say the U.S. urges Pyongyang to be more transparent with its defense activities for the sake of regional peace. If the report is true and Pyongyang has developed its capability, the U.S. will have to look into strengthening its missile defense systems on the West Coast as North Korea would be capable of hitting Alaska. U.S. bases in Japan, the Philippines and Guam would also be well within range of a North Korean strike launch from waters in Asia. Shizemin, Arirang News.